Hello everyone, welcome back to Stardew Valley and this incredibly hard, never done before challenge. Can we make 10 million gold without ever leaving the farm? Uh, year 1 is in the description if you want to go back and watch that. It was a lot of pain and suffering. Year 2, uh, I'm hoping it's going to be the money year. We're going to need to wait and see. Everything is set up nicely for us. Hopefully we get some good luck and we can make some serious money. We have not made a single friend in this, but we'll never leave the farm, so who cares? Okay, so we, here we are, Monday the 1st of uh, spring, not January, spring. Um, instantly starting the year off by taking a pickaxe to my rug. But here we are, this is spring. Oh, here we go, Jarhead's here. Alright, Kent. Hi there, my name's Kent, I just got back from Nam. Something that we did get on the very last day of winter was the ability to get iron now. So I will be able to get sprinklers. I'm making this farm automated as my number one goal for year two. Um, I've got to find a way to make money. Um, I do have 50 pine cones. Everything is getting sold. I need to make some money. We need to get, I think it's 25k before uh, we can get the fruit bats. It's running into the wall there. What is this? Acorn? Okay, that's an acorn. There we go, our first bit of iron. At last. Um Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna take these. There we go, mixed seeds, okay. First bit of mixed seeds of the year. Maybe. More mixed seeds, that is very good. Right, so that was nine mixed seeds just from this one area. Oh, make that ten. Uh, I'm gonna let I'm gonna continue to let this area grow out. Because uh, I think the more weeds there are, the more they grow. That could just be bullshit, but uh, I'm gonna go with it. Ah, still no iron. Oh my fuck, there's a lot of mushrooms. Oh, would it be worth me knocking this down? You know what, I will do. That might sell for some good money. You know what, I'm just gonna knock down the three big ones. Um, and we've still got all this to collect. We might be able to be able to get the fruit bats. Twenty-five thousand is what we need. And then Demetrius comes and says, "Hello there." The snow was ridiculous. Sadly, we only got four. Only four seeds from this whole area. Oh, now it's summer. This is where the money gets made. Spring has just been a waste of my time because now it's summertime. Um, the music's changed up. Everything is looking a little brighter. Everything, everything is coming into into place now. Everything, everything is just falling into place. Look at this. Combine those together. There we go. We've got another sprinkler. So I'm making this going to be automated eventually. I hope. I fucking hope so. Right, so eight of those are going to be manually operated. Ideally, I'd get some more seeds here, but no, it's not going to happen, is it? Uh, definitely not. Definitely not. Getting closer, though. As soon as I get 25, I get my fruit bats. Oh, man. Just under 700. Oh, rice, rice, rice. Oh, it's a wheat. Sorry, it's wheat. Um, That might be corn... The jeez, oh, very disappointed at the uh, the lack of corn, guaranteed corn. Um, that might be a beet. I think these are peppers. I think they are peppers. Um, um, oh, it's raining. Perfect. The first rainy day on the fifth of summer. Unreal. I forgot this water was sparkling. A horrible feeling whenever you have um whenever you have some kind of drink and you think like, oh this is water and you drink it. Like if it's Sprite, it could be Sprite in there, like it's someone else's, like your wife's or something, you don't know. And you pick it up and you take You think it's just Sprite. Sorry, you think it's just water and it's actually Sprite. And it's like sharp, and you're like, "What's happening? What is going on here?" Um, 
a lot of peppers. Also, it's the same the opposite way around. If there is a glass like this, and you think, oh, that's, that's a Sprite, that's Sprite. You pick it up and drink it, and it's just plain water. It's a horrible feeling. Hey, hey, I sells for abs hey, 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 hey. Hey sells for absolutely nothing, which is very upsetting. Uh, wheat sells, but I don't think it sells for much. Sell that as well. Um, another day for this. Yeah, another day for that. Uh, I can pick these peppers. That's a gold one. Just gonna sell them straight away because I don't have any way of uh, turning them into like pickled stuff yet, sadly. Um, so this is now only doing one. So I'm gonna move this to here where it'll do four. That is a genius decision. So I will need to manually water this in future. It's watered for today, and these aren't. Uh, but these will be sticking around for a little longer, so that's good. And water that, and then there's two more that need wards. These two. Hi, dog. Are you joking? Oh, yes! Dog move! Fucking hell, kick the dog all the way down the path. That's what we're talking about. Seven iron. So that's me getting another sprinkler at some point today. Sell for I should do that tonight. Oh, and a purple! Oh, that's good. Mushroom farm or uh, fruit bat research station. I say yes, please turn it to fruit bat because then it gives me fruit daily. Uh, I guess we want it here. It does two here, does two there. Let's just put it there. Short trip from the uh, house just to water these. So now these four are getting watered. These two and any that I put here are getting watered. These three and anything I put here is getting watered. And these two are indeed done by hand and that one there. So I only need to water by hand three things a day. So that is pretty, pretty, pretty good. Good yards, I'll fucking tell you. Let me fucking tell you. We are looking good. Oh, yes! Yes! Hi, Hannah, I have some good news. You definitely do. A few days ago, I made a breakthrough in my research on the local environment. I'll spare you the technical details to get to the point. You know that empty cave over there? A little ways to the west. Well, I have some... Uh, I have uh, a way to talk, uh, turn into something useful. For both of us. <laughs> for both of us. Um, I'd like to set up the cave to attract some local species, that way I can absorb them in a more controlled environment. And you can harvest whatever products they produce. I can either set up the cave to attract mushrooms, which sell for fucking low, or fruit, which can be turned into wine, can be turned into pickled stuff, jellied stuff, uh, and will give you a lot more money. Uh, so let me think hard about this, Bats. Alright, I'll get you uh, set up. And how are you going to set that up? Are you just going to put bats there yourself? I'm going. I'm ignoring this. I'm going straight to the cave to see what he's done. Now, either there's going to be nothing there yet. There's going to be the empty boxes, or there's going to be him like this. Uh, just thinking about it. Alright, it's nothing. Um, I don't know what I expected. Oh, is this done now? Right, there's a beat. Good time for this beat to be ready. I don't need to water it. And then I'm going to move this to here. Because then that these two will get watered. This one won't. So I'm now only watering one crop a day. After, after today. Right, is it farming? I'm starting to get worried that I don't know when I get the preserves jar. I don't know when it happens. Oh, fucking there it is! There it is! Just after saying that, it's right there. 
Uh, Iron Fence, won't bother with that. Water Cannon, Hope Proficiency. Preserves Jar, Basic Retaining Soil. That's going to be uh, a waste to me. Right, so now, now we're all good. Now we're all good. These by the fucking shitload. Sadly, I can only make one right now. It takes 40 stone? Oh, no. Um, stone's something I'm not getting that much of. Right. Well, I need more wood, more stone. Coal is actually the least of my problems. I've got a, a lot of coal. Yeah, because I can't get stones by going to the mines. I can't get stones by buying them from Robin. I need stones that spawn naturally on this land. And I need 40 per preserve jar, which is a lot. And one, two. Let's put the coal back in. i got seven stones now. That's how uh, punishing that is. Sadly, now that I have no things to, nothing to put in there. I sold all of my fruit and vegetables. But that's going to be something I'm going to be able to pickle stuff for uh, a long time to come. That is going to be like a huge part of my, um, my business model here. All these peppers will be going straight in. I need to water this one tile. That is also peppers. Did I miss that yesterday and that's why it's not regrown? Um, so yeah, what I'm going to do is come every day. <laughs> Fucking hell. I'm going to come in here every day. And uh, just throw all that stuff. Throw something in that jar every day. Rainy day, perfect. Right, so now it's all... It's, this is... This is the part of the, the game where it's all about going to be farming uh, jars. I want to make this place full of jars. I want outside full of jars. It's going to be jar, 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 jar bings. We are now in the process of we're actually making some money. Actually making some money. So these sell for 130 each. Every, every, every uh, pepper I get that would normally sell for 40, I can pickle it or jelly eyes it and it'll sell for 130. Uh, big thunder there. Oh lots of iron, this is very good. Was there something else I could have done with iron as well? Um, that is an earth crystal, that's never happened. There we go, this is what I want. I want some beehives. I forgot, I keep forgetting, I need to check this like every couple of days. Or just one thing. Oh, the dog's in the bed. I can't get in the bed. There we go. Kicked him out. Unreal. It's going to be interesting. Maybe. Right, can I make a beehive? Bee house. What am I missing? Eight coal. Right. Um, let me just put this in here for now. Bee house. Uh, take that back. Where should I put this? Um, put it right here, right beside the scarecrow. Maybe it'll get like uh, corn flavored, something like that. Never know. The wilderness golems can spawn on other farm layouts, provided the player has given a strange bun. Uh, or chosen the advanced option: spawn monsters on farm at new game creation. So there's a chance. There's a very slim chance that at night time in a game, a wilderness golem will spawn. And then there's an even slimmer chance that they will drop a... What is it? Earth Crystal! Oh no wait. I mean Earth Crystal would be good. I think there's something I can make with Earth Crystal. I forget what it is. Um... Wait, this one doesn't... Why does this one not drop one? This one drops like prismatic shards, diamonds, iridium ore. It might be worth trying to... Oh man, is this where the farm is going? Am I going to have to like grind? Like a serious, serious grind. 
uh, of wilderness golems just to get some of this stuff here. That's that might be how this goes. Uh, so for some reason, though, the stone golem, which can only be found in the mines, that drops quartz. One in ten drop quartz. Sadly, however, the only one I can get is this little derpy guy. And, uh, yeah, it does not drop quartz. I mean, it drops almost everything else that you could possibly want, including uh, iridium ore. Okay, so I've decided to move the my kind of blacksmith area down here. Just going to be a little bit closer, a little bit easier just to go here instead of all the way up here. It's lovely, lovely pepper day. Uh, my inventory's a little full. What is this I've got? Blackberry, wild plum, and salmon berry. That's right. Uh, I was, I was gonna, I was making a mix of different, uh, different stuff just to see what would be good, what would be bad in terms of uh, bothering to pickle it or not. Now is that a bat? It is. Okay. All right. So they're here. They're here. And uh, can I attack them with anything? One damage. Oh no. What about Scythe? Okay, Scythe might be the best. Although the knockback is like so strong. Let's try the axe. One. I'm not even going to attempt to do the, the whole... I just realised I've got like almost no energy. So I'm going to have to do it with the... Uh, it's going to have to be Scythe only. Um. Yeah, it's quite good to use... Oh, there it is! This is one of those guys we were researching. This has a chance of dropping a diamond. Chance of dropping a prismatic shard. Um, I'm doing 8 damage on him sometimes. Of course he just dropped fibre. Jeopardising my uh, my farm legacy. Alright, so salmon berry. Not worth it. It's taking up valuable space in my... Uh, in one of my preserved jars. Not worth it. Wild plum jelly. Amazing. That's the best one that's sold so far. Better even than uh, chili peppers, I think. Yeah, there were 130 chili peppers. Wild plum jelly, 210 gold. Um, well, let's put this chest just here. This is going to store all my monster drops. Uh, that fiber technically was a monster drop, sadly. A diamond, 1% drops, I get iridium ore. 1% that I get a prismatic shard. Okay, this is good. This is very good. Oh, this is like our first question, our first fork in the road. Do I want Forester? Trees drop 25% more wood. Let's say it drops 10 wood. Do I really want an extra two and a half pieces of wood? I mean, I don't really need it. I'm not short on wood. Gatherer. Chance for double harvest of foraged items. So foraged items, that can be, um, that can be anything that's in my little cave. So for the chance of me potentially being able to get two apricots, let's say, uh, instead of one, that is much more valuable to me than Forester. I don't see why I would ever go Forester. Uh, so this is what we have so far. And I'm going to stop the recording and jump back in after, let's say it's the 22nd now, I'm going to do, I'm going to fight every night for the rest of summer. And then we'll resume back in autumn. And I decided, you know what? I'm going to just kill every enemy that spawns. Sadly, it didn't get any iridium. This is what I got. I did get this, which I don't know what it is. A rare disc. I mean, it's just a it's just a thing for Gunther to, to play with. We're never going to meet Gunther in this playthrough. So uh, we don't need to worry about that. We can probably sell it. But I kind of like having this, uh, this little array of trophies for... Um, killing all these en there we go there it is there it is this is the thing that can drop iridium ore uh can drop a prismatic shard can drop all kinds of stuff a diamond although it'll probably just drop fiber it's only a one percent chance of it dropping something good mix seeds is good oh now that is a flower uh let me re fucking purpose these and put one here and one here so when this flowers 
these are not just going to be honey, they are going to be like star spangled honey or whatever it is. Poppy honey. I don't know what flower uh, comes out in was autumn. Things are only used for one thing. And that is the... Uh... Oh no! Oh no, I moved these here! But the flower, it's not even a flower, it's a fucking artichoke. Looking fine, and let's see how well we've done in here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven pieces of fruit. We're not going to be able to carry them all. Just to fit this in. There we go. So now we have five of these. And we're going to see, I bet the cherries, I bet cherry jelly goes for a lot of money. Let's see, what's this? 210 for cherry, 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 cherry jelly. I would have guessed more. Uh, and it wasn't even signed by him, but signed by his wife. Oh my fuck, look at this. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, fucking 15! 15 pieces of fruit! You ever seen this much fruit in your life? Uh, that's gonna be it for these crops, I think. I hope I get my farming rank up. I really do. Oh, yeah, the little bakery screen. Oh, yes, man! I actually did! Oh, that's, that's mining. Still. Uh, plus one ore per vein. That is huge. Gems to... Ah, fuck off. And um, I'm gonna want to make some more signs. I'm just gonna go mad with the signs. We have the uh, good old Canadian maple syrup. And then... Then, I think I can make two more beehives. Does not look centered at all, but fuck it. Um, and then we'll just we'll just start slamming these down. Start slamming, good boy, good boy. Wonderful. And get a little sign out the front here, just in case people are too stupid to realize. I don't have any honey actually. Now this is how we make money. These two and those two. Perfect. Get some cherries in there for the for this uh, jelly. And take the pickled eggplant as well. Now we're farming with portals. It's a Sunday, so let's do some business with the portals. Uh, what am I talking about? Uh, fuck off. That's good. That's good. Uh, and then let's just fucking replace that. Um, oh yeah, I better actually put these back down. Two, three, four. Now I can't put one there because I'll never be able to reach it. I have to put one there. Can I put this campfire back in here? Fucking nice one. Mina, it is currently the 14th. I'm sleeping a week at a time. So two more weeks. Uh, and I'll, I'll be ready. I'll be ready. You won't even know. Just be a good laugh, you know. Oh shit, where's all my fence? There's been a fucking... an attack. Anyway. Other than that, it was great. Other than that, I loved it. Uh, let's just do blackberries, fuck it. Oops. Oh. There we go. Easy. Easily. Easily done. And I've got all this to sell. All this to sell. You know what? Let's end the year right. Let's end the year right. Without any doubt. That's year two. That is year two done. Oh. That's an achievement. That do 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 do. I don't know what that was. Se oh, I thought I said 70. 7,000. Let's see, what made the most individually? Pomegranate jelly. 330G. Um, blackberry jelly, not worth my fucking time. Um, sadly, I've just filled, I think, all my caskets with that right now. There you go, year three. We will be kicking off year three in the next one. Oh, Grandad! 
Grandad, no! Oh fuck, it's my granddad! Didn't quite didn't quite time that right for the uh, for the effect. Never mind. My dear boy. Look at the state of this old bastard. You're dead. Leave me alone. Your time has gone. This is my time now. Please. Please. Uh, it's been many years since we last spoke. You were just a little boy, do you remember? Nah, I don't remember you at all. You mean nothing to me. Uh, look how far you've come. Oh, keep it PG please, Grandad. Uh, though you may have forgotten me. I've been here all along, just watching. Watching when you've been in the toilet, in the shower. You see, my body has departed this world. Well, actually, your body's in the world. We buried you. Your body is inside the world. Uh, but my heart will always remain in the start. No, your heart is also in the casket. It's, uh, we put it in landfill. Don't worry about it. There you go. Bye-bye. Thank you. Bye-bye now. Are you still here? You're still here. Um, you've been here two years now. Feels like longer. The farm hasn't changed much in these past few years, but that's okay. Even in death, he's, uh, even in death, the guy is still, still making fun of me. Evil old bastard. He should be down there. If you're enjoying your new life, that's all that matters to me. Uh, I'm going to purposely not enjoy that. <laughs> the future of my prison farm is now in your hands. Oh, it's in your hands now. Uh, it's been in my hands for a couple of years. I took over and it was absolutely shite. I've got it running amazingly well and I've not even left. Farewell. Right, bye bye. Catch you later. It's really nice to reconnect with loved ones like that. Really nice. Exotic spirits. Get fuck off, Gus. You're not getting a coconut. <laughs>